Hello, welcome to the Dave Verdan Show. I'm Greg Royce, joined by Stevenson Cross Country Head Coach Dave Verdan. And Coach, you guys didn't compete and meet this past weekend, but um, obviously got some training in. Um, so nice to get a little rest here in the middle of the season. Yeah, definitely. I mean, it wasn't really a rest for them. Right. Um, so the way it works for us is if on a week that we don't have a race, uh, I really up the training. So yeah. the volume was up, the intensity was up. They had one of their probably hardest workouts of the whole entire season on Friday. They had a double workout. They had a hard workout at 6 a.m. and then another, and then we yeah. did it again in the afternoon. So they were a little tired from that, but it's all, all in the plan. Yeah. Yeah, obviously we've talked about since the start of the season, the plan, obviously you're building towards conference meeting, NCAAs, mm -hmm. and, you know, it's, it must be nice to have that little bit of a gap where you can focus more on training rather than just, you know, resting for the next race. Yeah, exactly. I mean, that, yeah, you're right. Yeah. Um, however, you guys were a little bit busy this weekend. Um, you hosted the Spike Shoe Invitational on the Green Spring campus. Uh, high school meet attracted you know over five thousand people here in two sessions. Um, some of the best in the region. Just talk about that meet and how it went overall. Yeah, so I mean it went really well. So we had two sessions. We had an AM session and an afternoon session. And like you said, probably over five thousand people, counting the runners and the fans, were on on campus. And twenty three hundred runners ran in all the races. So yeah. so it was really we had some good times. Um, a lot of good feedback, and uh, it seemed like a positive experience for all. Yeah, it's obviously great for the program to have that many student athletes on campus. You know, even even if they don't decide to run in college, you know, maybe they see Stevenson and see the campus and decide this is a school they want to look more at. Exactly. Now, looking ahead to this week, you guys return to action. Um, another tough meet. You had to the Paul Short Invitational at Lehigh University. Um, you know, a meet that's very very well known. Um, you know, has a mix of Division One, Two, II, and Three. Um, there's three races. Talk about or discuss what you're looking to get out of this meet going against some of the top schools in Division One, and then even, you know, some of the top schools in Division Two and Division Three. Yeah, so there's almost 130 schools entered. Um, we, we're not 100% sure yet what races we're in, but um, it, it, whatever race we're in, it's going to be a good opportunity yeah. for both the men and the women to be competitive. And, and again, just like Van Cortland, um, that was a hard course when, yeah. we're, when we're at Van Cortland Park. This course is it's an average cross-country course, so it's really – kind of that first opportunity for them to run some pretty quick times yeah. and it's going to be really deep i mean it, van Cortland was competitive but it wasn't a deep field right. i mean this is going to be 400 plus runners in each race so yeah. so they're just going to be be out there competing and trying to beat as many people as they can is it a little bit of a preview maybe for the conference meet where you have you know the whole 16 17 teams rather than you know you normally race against eight nine ten teams and get to conference meet and all 17 schools are there this race be a little deeper is that kind of preview of that in terms of there's more runners on the course so you have to kind of pace yourself and know know when to make your move yeah definitely it's it's even more so for um regionals and potentially nationals because regionals we have 70 72 teams at regionals in our in our region so um you're right yeah i mean it's a good opportunity to get used to running and in those big groups of people and just being competitive and and getting out fast too getting out fast and but not too hard and then just running a good hard honest like even race the whole time yeah absolutely um well coach best of luck on friday um we'll look forward to seeing your results from there for dave or dan i'm greg royce and this has been the dave or dan show